Okay, we're in an absolutely gorgeous Morris 8 1946. This car is just beautiful all around, it really is. We're going to go for a bit of a test drive, let's see how much fun it is. It's a lovely sunny day, we've got the sliding roof open. I'm going to demonstrate the air conditioning for you in a minute. This is a lovely car and I enjoy driving it and I love what I do for a living selling these beautiful old machines. Nineteen forty six Morris eight C U Z two door coupe. Great fun car this. Lovely, lovely, ready to enjoy. Just get your picnic, get your sandwiches. Wants nothing doing, just go and enjoy yourself. Look how lovely it is in here. I'll shut that sliding roof after and take some pictures. With the roof closed. Not just got immaculate carpets with mats, look, they're, they're just over mats. The main carpet says it's still underneath them, as well as these overmats that have been whipped on the edges to protect them. Brake light dash all intact, tilting screen, even got the little bracket down there to put your bonnet catch up there down there. Headlining is gorgeous, got the headlamp extensions on which are an optional extra, chrome work on that front bumper is really good. Chrome work on the hubs is good. Very straight on the panels. Paintwork's not immaculate. It's got, it is what it is. It's a lovely, well presented old car. But if you want to come and find fault with the paintwork, you can do. But look at what we're seeing on this video. Something that's ready to enjoy. Go and have some fun with this summer. Okay, well, this is your air conditioning look, your tilting screen. There you go, that compressor will never stop working, will it look? And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to brake quite sharply, or as sharply as 1946 brake can out. But here we go, we're going to stop now. Oh, they're very good there, actually. Yes, quite impressed. Stop throwing the squirrel in, in the middle of the road, no vibrations. And off we go again. Morris 8 Series A start up and we'll have a look under the engine bay. We've got the hood up at the minute. There you go, she starts up very readily on the electric starter. And look at that, ticking away like a little finger throwing machine. Lovely little. Cylinder engine there, just bubbling away nicely. You've got your jack there and your starting handle, your wheel brace. Quick look on the boot here, we have got a spare wheel, very solid boot corners, got a stirrup pump there, and the tool roll. Everything you need, including the old-fashioned grease cut there. Had no way. Look at that look. Lovely. Beep, beep. Okay, Morris. Uh, Morris eight underside. We're going to start in this back corner because this is where we are. No playing that wheel bearing there. The wheel's moving freely. Nice solid petrol tank. Again, no play in the wheel bearing. The wheel's moving freely. Important to notice here, we have got the vehicle picked up on four blocks on the sills. So, that's how solid the car is, look. We're on the actual sills, not on the chassis rails. I'm bit picked up, it's absolutely solid. See underneath there, it's all solid. No playing that burden, there's no wobble or anything in that. Possibly that brake's just binding a bit on that front wheel. That one's working well. You can see all those chassis legs. No issues at all. 
just a solid underneath. Let me get that on the cell. Nice solid little car. Right, I'm not sure these cars, well, modern cars, old cars, let's show them on full lock because it, it's making sure there's no problems with the steering or clunking or anything. So there we go, this is full lock on my look. Look at these old cars, they turn on the six months, don't they? In the modern mini, it's, you need a shunt on that junction. Right, I'm just going to reverse round here and we'll do it the same but the other way around. Nice smooth clutch, no crunching when we're going into gear. And so this is full up the other way. No problems at all. people mix videos the way that we do for the cars that we sell, particularly these old classics. We're absolutely passionate about these cars and we love having them for a short period of time while we find them a new home. If you want to talk about owning a car like this and the fun to bring, just give us a ring and have a chat. We, uh, we genuinely 